What's up, my people? Got a stain on my shirt. What's up, my people? I hope y'all are ready to learn. You are learning from Sticks herself. Um, I'm very excited today because I feel great. I feel amazing. I feel positive. I feel ready to attack the world. So, I love the twist out. Thank you. Hold on. All right, so my Leo placements are at an all-time high today, okay? Just so you know, my Leo placements are at an all-time high today. My fire placements are at an all-time high today. So be aware that I, I, might, I might start yelling. I, I just might start yelling. <laughs> but um, I really have a lot of things that I want to talk about. I really want to get on live later on today also. But um, I know that there are a lot of things that I can say right now that can definitely change some lives. So, and I don't mean it like, I'm going to say some things. No, 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 no. I got some information that I know somebody needs to hear because deep in my heart, all I keep wanting to do is reach out to people to just talk to them and tell them things that I think can truly change their life. So I'm here on live. Okay. Sticks, I missed you, my lifesaver. Hi there, Gabs. What's up? What's up, Ro? What's up, Ro? Ro? What's up? Listen, I'm so excited today. Why am I so excited today? Because I got the keys for you today. I got the keys for you today. And um, I just hope you are ready. I don't even know where to start today. But let's just start off with let's just start off with the fact that I went to Barnes and Noble and I bought a whole bunch of books. Okay, we're gonna start off with that. Um. We're going to start off with that. So first of all, I got a whole bunch of books today. And thanks for the end. I didn't send out any invites. I didn't send out any invites. I'm surprised. But um, first of all, let's just talk about it. All right. One thing that I've realized these past couple of days the most is we are ultimately in control. Right. I don't think we want to believe that because... If we believe that we were in control, then obviously you would have to face what you're looking at in front of you. A lot of people don't want to face that because they want to blame something else, right? Oh, I'm at a job I don't like. Oh, I'm at a house that I don't like. Oh, I'm around people I don't like. You got to understand, man, everything is created by your mind because that's how this, this world was created, by the mind, right? So how can we create a world that we do want? Right. How can we create a world that we do want? And it's by using our mind to do that. Right. So what do I mean by that? Using your mind is as simple as using your thoughts to create your reality. Right. A lot of people don't want to be that. A lot of people don't want to believe that. Right. So this is what I'm going to say. This is what I'm going to say. First of all, I've read a few books. Right. And I've bought a whole bunch of books and They've allowed me to understand what I already know, but an ability to express it in a way that are able to, that is able to be explained, right? So first of all, the here's one book that I have, The Power of Awareness by Neville Goddard, right? Let me explain this to you, okay? Because I'm going to read something simple to you too, right? Because I read a little bit and let me, let me, let me read this right here, okay? You must assume the feeling of wish fulfilled into your assumption has all the sensory vividness of reality right so what does that mean that means that if there is something that you want in your life if there is something that you want to manifest in your life you have to assume that it's already here right now okay somebody said what book again the book is called the power of awareness all right the power of awareness the Power of Awareness by Neville Goddard, right? So I think 
we don't realize how in control we actually are, right? You know, a lot of people want to be wealthy, but a lot of people are not realizing that wealth is a mindset. So in order to have wealth as a mindset, you have to change the way you think. And then once you change the way you think, then your life will represent what is inside of you. Because your, yes, um, I got this from Barnes and Nobles, but you can get online, right? Why they banned me on my, man, because sometimes people be talking crazy, bro. Sometimes people be talking crazy, right? So let me explain something to you. How many of y'all truly want to learn how to manifest? How many of y'all truly want to learn how to change your life? Because you know what? You know what I truly what I truly want to tell you? The power of awareness. What I truly want to tell you is you can change your life. You can change your life. But the thing about it is that you have to listen to what I say. Okay? You have to listen to me. You can't doubt it. You cannot doubt it. All right? Because listen to me right? My life has changed. I'm the ghost face. I'm not negative or talk. Then we probably made a mistake. You know what I'm saying? My life has changed when I changed my mind. I am the happiest I've ever been. If you look at me, I'm glowing, right? So let me tell you something. How can I change my life sticks? How can I change my life? Okay, cool. First thing that I'm going to need you to do is you're going to need to start reading some books that can train you on your mind, right? So, let's 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 go ahead and let's go through a few books, okay? Now listen, has your life changed significantly or financially? Actually, yes. Yes, actually. I recently just got a new car. I went from a Honda and now I have a Mustang. You know? I'm financially free. I make music. My music pays me. I have a business. My business pays me. My business pays me. You know what I'm saying? My social media pays me. You know? So I I, I think I can talk for real, you know? And here's the thing. Everything changed when I changed my mind. Okay? Everything changed when I changed my mind right because you got to understand money listen to me okay before you sit here and think oh my god how do i i I just need to get a different job i need to just do this no no this is what i'm trying to tell you wealth is a mindset wealth is a mindset wealth is a mindset Some of y'all are looking at the outside world to change your life when you need to be looking internally first, right? And what I mean by this is, and I'm about to tune out real quick, okay? And what I mean by tune out is, I'm not going to read any comments. I'm about to just go, okay? I recommend everybody screen record this, all right? I recommend everybody screen record this, all right? And when you screen record this, make sure you post it or, you know what I'm saying? But hear me out, okay? I'm about to tune in and I'm about to, all right, boom. Hey, screen record, screen record, all right? Screen record, okay? All right, here we go. First thing that you have to change is your mind. In order to change your mind, you have to reprogram your mind. What people fail to realize is that your mind has already been programmed by society, and that's the problem. Some people think that making money or living a life that you want to live takes so much hard work, but that's a false way of thinking you want to know why because everything in this world is mental you want to know why because let's think about it if you play sports or if you play chess then you understand what i'm about to say every single thing that they tell you is 90 percent mental and 10 percent physical why is that because there is a law called the all is mine the law of mentalism in the cabalion the law of mentalism states that all is mine everything comes from thought every single thing that we think of every single thing that we've ever grabbed on every single thing that we felt attracted to came from somebody's mind mind first right for example this t-shirt that i'm wearing somebody manifested a clothing brand that now i wear right exactly there is a tiktok that you're looking at right now that i manifested and i manifested to have a lot of followers which is why you're here right now so when you realize that everything is a form of thought then you'll understand that the form of thought that you choose is what creates your reality so you have society telling you that you need to work super hard in order to be rich. You want to know why they brought you like that and they taught you like that? The reason why is because they understood that if you, the employer, could think, oh my God, I have to work so hard, then you would be a great employer. But guess what? 
In nine to five lifestyle, the harder you work does not mean the more you get paid, right? Think about it. The more you work does not mean the more you get paid in this nine to five capitalism lifestyle, which is why they want you to work hard. They don't want you to understand that everything is in the mental. So they tell you work hard, work hard, work hard. But let's talk about it. If you work hard, work hard, work hard, you're probably on a salary and you're probably working for $11 an hour, $12 an hour, $30 an hour, whatever it is, it is a solid number for that much an hour. So why do they tell you to work so hard if you working so hard only gives you the same amount? You want to know why? because it feeds into capitalism right what it is is that they don't want you to know that your mind is what actually equals out to abundance everything is a spiritual thing why because we are spiritual beings having a human experience so before you go out into the world looking for your answers you need to check in with your spiritual self first right now this is what i mean some of you guys don't make a lot of money because of the way that you think right what does that mean some of y'all be afraid to spend money why are you afraid to spend money because you have a fear concept connected to money hear what i just said some of you guys are afraid to spend money because you have a fear concept connected to money so when you spend money you feel afraid right you feel afraid this is because your relationship with money is difficult you rely on money you are codependent on money money is an abundance right abundance is a frequency in order to tap into this frequency you have to live at this frequency right and a lot of you guys may not believe me but that's okay because guess what oprah said herself i don't f with oprah because i already know oprah's a part of some weird stuff but you got to understand that even these higher people understand what we don't why is it that these elites are so successful and so rich why because they understand what we don't which is understanding the mind Oprah talks about manifesting. She says, in order to be ready for your manifestation, you have to match the vibrational frequency of that. Some of you are living a happy life because you are in a happy frequency. Some of you live a negative life because you are in a negative frequency. Let's talk about this, right? Some of y'all are depressed and some people are happy. You and I are no different. So what's the difference between me and you, right? What's the difference between my life and your life? And what I mean is me and you are no different in our makeup, in our build. We have hair, we have hands, we have a mind, right? So what is different between you who may be depressed, sad or whatever, second from the person who is happy and successful? It is your mind. Why? Because your thoughts create reality. So when you think negative thoughts like, man, if it ain't one thing, it's another, right? Let's say this, something breaks down, right? Let's say something breaks down in your house and now you have to pay for it, right? The first thing that you think about is, oh man, I got to pay for something. I got to pay for this, right? But you're not realizing that if you would have thought positively, what you would have thought it was, oh my gosh, Something broke down, but I have the means to pay for it. I am so blessed. Some of y'all, y'all have the money, right? But this is what you think. You'll think, oh my God, I got to pay for something. Oh my God, I got to do this. Oh my God, I got to do that. Oh my God, I got to do this. No, because you got to understand things will always break down. Situations will always happen. But how you react to those situations is what gives you the result of blessing or another curse. Some of y'all have negative situations come in y'all life and y'all don't take it as a opportunity to be better, better. You're not understanding that you need to take it as an opportunity to be better. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram and subscribe to me on YouTube if you understand what I'm saying. And I know I am going fast. I know I'm speaking fast, but I told y'all my fire placements are on fire today. Okay, so let me tell you something, right? How can I change my life sticks? How can I, how can I be wealthy? How can I, let me tell you something. Every single wealthy person that's probably on YouTube, every single wealthy person that you probably talk about, every single time you ask them, hey, how do I be wealthy? The first thing that they're going to tell you is, well, you need to change your mind because the, the way that you think is stopping you from growing. And that's true because guess what? When you have negative mindset, you're not able to see you're not able to see the opportunities for you, right? So for example, let's talk about it, right? Some people, when the whole, when the whole pandemic situation happened, some people was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, I'm stuck at home, I'm stuck at home. And some people took that as, oh my God, everything's about to end. Some people took that as an opportunity to make things happen. I'm one of those people. When everything was going to shit and everything was negative, I said, you know what? Let me get my phone, let me make an opportunity and let me find a way to 
make people think more positive by using what I have. Take lemons and make the lemonade, right? Some of y'all take a negative situation. Remember, negative and positive situations are all perspectives, right? Perceptions. Perceptions. So what you may deem as negative, I may deem as an opportunity, right? And that's the reason why of my personal, my person. <laughs> moderators meeting left folks left right that's because of my personal way of thinking which is positive right so let me tell you something there are people there are things that i read such as think and grow rich right that's the first book that you can start with think and grow rich you have to first know what it is that you want once you know what it is that you want then you have to somebody's calling my name who is this Dej. i can't even see your i see you i see you calling my name I can't even see your picture. I see that it says days. What's up? But like I said, though, you got to understand that everything is the way that you think. Wealth is a mindset. Let me tell you something, right? I've had two people that I've taught how to manifest. I've taught my mom how to manifest and I taught my sister how to manifest, right? Let me tell you something because we're going to get deep into it and I'm going to tell you how to manifest everything that you want. But hear me out. I'm going to give you the testimony real quick. All right. Somebody said, this can't be your real voice. Yes, it is, girl. It is, right? So let me tell you something. My mom was not really the most spiritual person, right? But she started to see how my life was changing because of what I was learning, which was, you know, manifesting, right? So she was like, hey, girl, like, put me on. Like, what's going on? What crystal can I use or whatever? I was like, you know, Mom Saget is one crystal that I use for wealth, you know. At the time, she was looking to manifest more money. So I said, all right, Mom, here, this is what you do. Get this crystal that you want, right? And when you get this crystal that you want, what I want you to do is grab this incense, okay? This incense that I gave her was frankincense, right? Frankincense allows you to cleanse crystals, right? So she got this crystal and I said, here, say this affirmation. I don't chase, I attract. And what I want you to do is, I want you to imagine money coming to your bank account. I want you to imagine yourself financially free. I want you to speak these affirmations. Hi, I am I am successful. I am this, I am that. I money comes to me. Success is inevitable, right? Do you know that week she ended up manifesting a job opportunity that now pays her $50 an hour? Hold on. My mom manifested a job off of what I taught her and she manifested a job that gives her $50 an hour, right? So then I taught my sister. I said, hey, let me teach you a way of manifesting. She was very Christian. Now she's opening herself up to spirituality, right? So I told her, hey, this is what you got to do. What I want you to do is watch this video, right? It's one of my videos on my YouTube. What I want you to do is close your eyes before you go to sleep. I want you to imagine what it is that you want to manifest. And when you imagine what it is that you want to manifest, you have to feel the emotion. So imagine yourself getting what you wanted it what you wanted to manifest and imagine how you would react to it right she told me that she did the manifestation and she said she ended up crying i said that's perfect why is that perfect because when you cry your emotions is a chemical reaction right so when you imagine something your body doesn't know oh my god this is something that happened in the past or this is something that happened in the future they your body doesn't know because why there is no such thing as past present or future right so what I'm trying to understand is that somebody said, this is what Forex people is doing, baby. This is not Forex. This is not Forex. I wish I was good at Forex, though. But so when I told her, I said, this is what you got to do. She was like, I cried. And I, you know what I'm saying? So she started to cry, which meant that her body started to think, oh, my God, I'm celebrating. Oh, my God, I'm dealing with something. Tell me why my sister was just offered a modeling contract to an agency the same week that she did the manifestation. And she got an audition to New York Fashion Week. Right? Right? So, my thing is, yes, I am a life past seven. So, my thing is, my sister, mind you. Mind you, hold on, before y'all even think, oh my God, she's lying. First of all, me and my sister at the at the the holiday get togethers me and her would be arguing about christianity and spirituality that was my sister but then i explained to my sister about manifesting right once she started to manifest why is it that now her life is completely changing she is she she has a contract for a modeling agency right so now, why did this work so well for my sister? Why did this work so well? Let me tell you why this works so well, okay? And I'm going to explain this scientifically because I know some people may not understand it. Let me explain this scientifically, okay? 
first of all, imagination, okay? Now, imagination is a very powerful thing. Why is imagination very powerful, right? Because let's talk about it. There is no such thing as real, right? And if you ever watch Matrix, then you know what I'm talking about. And make sure y'all follow me on Instagram, subscribe to me on YouTube, and make sure you guys check out my crystal shop. The link is in the bio, right? There is, whatever the price is, I'm not selling my soul. Of course not. Of course not. We need our soul, all right? So, listen to me. No, Nothing is real, right? Because what is real? You may say, what is real? Real is touch, taste, smell, and hear, right? Nah. Because what is real? If you think that that is real, right? Touch, taste, smell, and hear, then real is just simply signals that you're receiving from the brain, right? Think about it. Your physical senses is touch, taste, smell, and hear. If you say touch, taste, smell, and hear is what's real, then you're saying that only something physical, only something physical is what we consider real. That's incorrect because guess what? We all know that we are a spirit living in a physical body, right? So our dreams, our dreams, right? What are our dreams? Our dreams is a very special thing where we are able to travel. You got to understand that there are different realms, right? There are different levels of consciousness. There are different levels of experience, right? Our dream world is somewhere else that we are able to experience. Our daydreams is something else that we are able to experience. Our imagination is something else that we are able to experience, right? And some of y'all may be like, well, my dreams aren't real. How are your dreams not real if sometimes, right? Sometimes your dreams can tell you what's about to happen in the future. Why is that? Why is that? Right? Why is that? Right? So let's talk about it. Imagination. Your imagination is important because your imagination is what allows you to create. Right? So let's talk about it. You want to create a drawing, right? You want to you want to create a, a new world. You want to create something, right? In order for you to imagine, I mean, well, in order for you to create a new drawing, to draw or to write, you have to think about what it is that you want to write, okay? So this is proven that your mind is the first process in creating anything, right? In creating anything. Steve Jobs had to imagine what the iPhone had to look like first before it came to reality, right? Our, our, all this technology had to be imagined first before it was drawn out and became something that is in the physical, right? So we think about it. We think about all these little models that we create to, oh, let's create a little sample. Let's create a sample. When you create a clothing line, right, don't you have to imagine what you want the idea to be before you put it on Photoshop, before you then put it on a t-shirt, then before it comes into reality and now you have a t-shirt in your mailbox? Do you see how that happened, right? Think about it. To create a t-shirt that you want, you have to think about the design that you want, right? Once you think about it, then what do you do? You put it on a piece of paper, you draw it out, right? Then what do you do? You put it on Photoshop, then you put it on the t-shirt, and now the t-shirt is now sent to your home, and now you have a t-shirt with your design. That design came from your mind. That is a form of manifestation, right? So the same thing can happen in your life. The only thing that people don't understand is that your imagination is what creates your reality. Why do you think that SpongeBob episode was so big? Imagination imagination right so let's talk about it how can i manifest this okay here are the step-by-step -step explanation on how to manifest your life okay first thing first you need to figure out what it is that you want what it is that you want right who it is that you want to be right once you figure out what it is that you want who it is that you want to be okay second thing that you need to do is you need to close your eyes find a space that you know you can continuously meditate at right find this space close your eyes and then you want to imagine yourself living that moment as if it's happening right now right like where, where, where that book at where my book at right i'm gonna read a part of it i'm gonna read a part of it for you okay 
You must assume the feeling of the wish fulfilled until your assumption has all the sensory vividness of reality. You must imagine that you are already experiencing what you desire. That is, you must assume the feeling of the fulfillment of your desire until you are possessed by it. And this feeling crowds all other ideas outside of your consciousness. So, you, what you have to do is imagine yourself... The Power of Awareness by Neville Goddard. What you have to do is imagine yourself as if you are experiencing the success now. Now. Don't stop manifesting. Oh, here's the thing. Stop manifesting and saying, oh, I'm going to be a millionaire. I'm going to be a millionaire. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. The book is called The Power of Awareness, okay? I'm going to do this. I'm going to be that. I hope I change your words. You need to affirm that it is now. Why do you need to affirm that it is now? Because guess what? All you have is now. All you have is right now. Why? Because there's no such thing as the future and there's no such thing as the past. So if the only thing that is real is right now, why would you manifest something to be in the future that is not even real? Because think about it. There is no such thing as the future if you really think about it. There is no such thing as the future. All there is is right now. Right now, right? Right now. So, let's, let, let, let's, let's talk about it. Let's talk, let's, let's talk about it. Let's talk about it, right? It is only by a change of consciousness. What's the name of the book? The book is named The Power of Awareness, right? It is only by change of consciousness, by actually changing your concept of yourself, could you build more stately mansions. The manifestations of higher and higher concept, right? Consciousness is the one and only reality. It is the first and only cause substance of the phenomenon of life, right? So what, I'm, what that means is that you gotta believe. <laughs> if you don't believe it, it will not happen, right? And I know, listen... I know when you start to manifest, it's going to be very hard, right? So, for example, let's say you want to manifest a new car. Whatever car it is that you're driving, you need to act. You, you need to act like that car is that Maserati, that Ferrari, whatever it is. You need to act. You want to know why? Because your physical senses, you cannot trust the physical. Why can't you trust the physical? Because the physical is a reflection. The physical is only the effect, right? So, for example, if I am looking at a phone, right? Let, let me give you an example. You're looking at me in this phone, right? But guess what? I can almost guarantee you that what I'm saying right now is delayed on your side, right? So I can say something here and it will take you three to four seconds for you to hear me say it on your side. That is the same thing with the universe, right? You can see yourself in a different way in your mind, but the universe has a delayed process until it comes into reality. So just because you don't see it right now does not mean that it is not in your reality, right? Let me give you another example, right? Let's say this was a walkie-talkie, right? If this is a walkie-talkie, a walkie-talkie has many different channels, right? And all the different channels have different frequencies, right? So if we were talking on this walkie-talkie, right? And I'm on frequency 97.5 and you're on frequency 97.2, you're not going to hear me because you're not on my frequency. I'm on the device now. You know I'm here. You know you could talk to me. You know I'm in reality, but you can't hear me if you're not on my frequency. Your manifestation is on another frequency, and sometimes you're not able to see that your manifestation is there because you're not on the same frequency to see it. How do I get to that frequency? By assuming that you are already that. That's how you jump to the frequency. Ask yourself and carry yourself well, not ask yourself, carry yourself as if you're already successful now. And that's how the universe will bring into that reality, right? 
period. Now, a lot of you guys are probably asking, well, what is the crystal that your mom used to manifest? What is the crystal? Listen, man, I'll put you on all of that. But first, before you even jump to any crystals, you need to understand that ain't no crystal going to work until your mindset is on the right frequency for it to work. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is I'm Sticks River. And make sure y'all subscribe to me on YouTube. Right? So, listen, man. I done bought so many books. Teaching, right? So, look. I got this book, Daily Teachings, right? I'm going to read one of these pages to you, okay? I'm going to read one of these pages to you, all right? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pick a random page, all right? I'm going to pick a random page, okay? All right? So, 25. You can change the path of your life from dark to light or from negative to positive. Every single time you focus on the positive, you are bringing more light into your life. And you know that light removes all darkness. Gratitude, love, kind, thoughts, words, and actions bring light and eliminate the darkness. Fill your life with the light of positivity, right? Another one. What does it feel like to be in harmony with the universe? It is the same feeling when you float on water. If you are tense or you resist the water, you will sink. If you surrender to the water, the water will support you and you will float. That is the feeling and that is how you harmonize yourself with the universe. Let the tension go and float. Come on, y'all, man. I do this. I do this, man. This is my life. I am in the business of changing people's life. I am in the business of helping people. You want to know why? Because the more I help, the more I receive. The more I give, the more I receive. Right? So a lot of y'all may be like, Sticks, why are you helping us? Because you got to understand, I am the universe. You are the universe. So when I help you raise the frequency, guess what? My dream of waking the masses starts to become reality. Why do you think my TikTok became successful? Because I manifested that I wanted to help people awaken. Period, right? Period. Period, right? And if you want to support me, you can go ahead and go get you a crystal. I don't take donations. I don't take donations. But what you can do is you can check out the crystal shop on the link in my bio and you can get you a crystal. Now, a lot of people may be like, how does crystals even work, Sticks? How does crystals even work? Let me tell you scientifically because i know a lot of y'all don't understand things unless it is scientific okay so let me tell you crystals emit a frequency right crystals are known to absorb and crystals are known to emit frequencies right it is proven by science how is it proven by science because guess what your phone your rock your watches your tvs they all use crystals to either amplify the signal that is going through that motherboard right so let me tell you something Crystals are able to emit frequencies that your electromagnetic field is able to absorb. Remember, you have an aura, right? What is the scientific version of your aura? Your electromagnetic field, right? Your electromagnetic field can pick up on other frequencies from other people's electromagnetic fields or from other things' electromagnetic fields, right? So let me tell you something. There are certain crystals that will bring abundance to you. How can a crystal bring me money, Sticks? A crystal can bring you money because guess what? Money is a frequency. How many times have you heard that? Abundance is a frequency. How many times have you heard that? Remember, I told you your manifestation is at a certain frequency. So guess what? A crystal can help you. How can a crystal help you? Because if you meditate with that crystal, you are now absorbing that crystal into your electromagnetic field, right? I know I am very animated right now, but I told you my Leo placement is on fire right now. All right. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram and subscribe to me on YouTube. My crystal shop is in the link in my bio. All right. Now, let me tell you something. There is a crystal. There are a few crystals on my um, crystal shop that I can tell you about, but I'm going to ask you, okay? What is it that you're looking for? What is it that you're looking for in crystals? Are you looking for something to heal your anxiety? Are you looking for something for money? Are you looking for something for overthinking? Are you trying to open your third eye? Are you trying to get better at manifesting? Are you trying to get better at meditating, okay? What is it? What is it? What is it? What do you want? All right, for my overthinking. If you deal with overthinking, I recommend amethyst for your overthinking or clear quartz, okay? If you have anxiety, amethyst, chevron amethyst is all good, okay? So, communication is speaking up. If you have a problem with communication, I recommend lapis lazuli, right? I also recommend angelite and I recommend blue lace agate. 
lapis lazuli is one of the most powerful throat chakra crystals okay so um need help with my emotions and overthinking if you need help with your emotions get rose quartz if you need help with your overthinking get amethyst to be more organized get fluorite and tiger's eye i want to open my third eye and my root get carnelian for your root chakra for your third eye go ahead and get amethyst or clear quartz anxiety amethyst complete soul purpose get moonstone moonstone will help you to understand what your purpose is it will also help you to understand new beginnings for wealth for money i'm going to definitely tell you right now pay attention if you are manifesting money write this down okay and the link is in my bio click crystal shop to get these crystals these crystals are all ethically sourced so they do sell out very fast so if you want to be a victim of not getting your crystals go ahead and wait but if you want to get your crystal and get it before it sells out go ahead and click the link in the bio click crystal shop okay so for wealth let me tell you for wealth citrine moss agate pyrite moonstone green aventurine okay green aventurine all right green aventurine the third eye chevron amethyst regular amethyst clear quartz and labradorite is great for the third eye who is your master my mind good one for block just whole life just block it depends on what's blocked you got to ask yourself right you can do a chakra test. Go on Google and look up chakra test, and that way you can figure out what exactly is blocked. For productivity, get fluorite and get tiger's eye. I also have one on my website called fluorite with pyrite. I don't know if that one sold out, but that one is a very powerful abundance crystal. Hmm. Fluorite is great for focus, for creativity and independence. Carnelian carnelian for creativity all right connect with the divine spirit guides and ancestors regular amethyst amethyst clear quartz okay amethyst and clear quartz to speak clearly lapis lazuli for love life rose quartz what about manifesting moss agate pyrite all right moss agate pyrite moonstone can you start the crystals can you start the crystal you just said right away what do you mean I fell off my journey and I'm trying to get back in tune with myself. Literally just binge watch all my YouTube and, and um, TikTok videos. You talking about Steven Universe? You peep something. I'm not talking about Steven Universe, but Steven Universe was ahead of something. They understood crystals. Crystals for confidence is carnelian. But look, let me go get my laptop because I'm going to explain everything to you. All right? Hold on. I'm going to explain everything to you. I'm going to explain every single thing to you. All right? I got my pink tourmaline right here, all right? So, boom. Go ahead, write at... Listen, all you got to do is comment what it is that you're looking for, and I will tell you what it is that you need, all right? Okay? Comment what it is that you're looking for, and I'll tell you what it is that you need. Can you talk about ego? Um. Well, honestly, like... Hold on, hold on. Let me just answer these questions, okay? So... And the link is in the bio. The link is in the bio. Click Crystal Shop. If your order is over $50, use this code Ship Me to have free shipping, right? Okay. All right. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go. So, all right. Boom. I'm on the website right now. Click the link in the bio. Click Crystal Shop. And I'm about to explain everything to you, okay? So, I know somebody said... Um, All right, cool. Hold on. Hold on. All right, so for confidence, for confidence, for confidence, the crystals for confidence right here. I'm about to, I'm about to tell you right now because I got it right here on the website, right here on the website, all right? So the crystals for confidence, fluorite with pyrite, okay? I have fluorite with pyrite, all right? Fluorite with pyrite will guide you down the path of abundance and blessing and is also great for confidence. Also, African bloodstone is great for confidence. Moss agate is great for confidence. Green onyx is great for confidence. And wire-wrapped labradorite and lapis lazuli is also great for confidence, okay? Laziness. Laziness, if you deal with laziness, if you deal with laziness, tiger's eye can you add what crystals do on your website? Yes, I do. I have it on there. If you click the link in the bio and you click crystals, you'll find out. So crystals for laziness is fluorite and tiger's eye, okay? 
love manifesting and wealth for love get rose quartz for manifesting get pyrite get citrine or get moss agate and for wealth well that's the same thing pyrite moss agate you know citrine does the size of the crystals matter the bigger the crystal the more energy all right help with astral projection all right astral projection caribbean calcite all right caribbean calcite sounds like a lot of sorcery sounds like you're afraid of something Sounds like you're afraid of something. What if I told you that everything that they demonized to you was actually an ancient practice that your ancestors were aware of? Purpose, meditation. Fluorite with pyrite was great for purpose, right? Is there a crystal for lonely, loneliness? Um, Picasso Jasper. Picasso Jasper. What is, Chris, what is crystals mean? Is that a pillar? No, crystal is a... Uh, Think of it like a crystal, like a rock, okay? Crystals for synchronicities and magic. Lapis lazuli, labradorite, rose quartz, okay? Procrastination, fluorite. Guys, this is selling out extremely fast on the website, so I recommend y'all get it as soon as possible. You go ahead, I'm telling you. All right? I'm telling you, it's selling out as fast as possible, so link in the bio, all right? I need something to help my period cramps. Carnelian, carnelian, carnelian. But let me go ahead and... Carnelian. And labradorite. Crystals against depression. I got the perfect one. Crystals for depression. Carnelian, smoky quartz, labradorite. And moss agate. All right? Why do I why I need stones to improve me when I have power over matter? Why do you need food to help you live? Okay? All right. You need food, right? There are certain things. I'm not saying you need crystals, but there are tools that you can use, all right? So, how can you cleanse your crystals at home? So, I just added something on my website called selenite. You can get selenite and put it near your crystals and it will naturally cleanse your crystals, okay? All right. So let me go ahead and read off a few things, right? Let me read off Labradorite for you, okay? So Labradorite has two characteristics, magic and protection, okay? This is all in the link in my bio, okay? Link in the bio, click Crystal Shop. This is what Labradorite looks like. This is what the Labradorite on my website looks like, okay? So see, you have one-on-one -on -one sessions? Yes, DM me. Labradorite has two characteristics, magic and protection. Labradorite is great for... Um, increasing your faith and trust. It helps you strengthen your psychic ability. It also boosts your self-determination, right? It aids in self-doubt, discouragement, and depression, right? It protects you from psychic attacks, all right? And it has great impacts on wealth, business, career growth, and life expectations. All right? That's Labradorite. That's Labradorite. Listen, there is 50 people on the website, all right? So again, I would not wait, okay? How often do you cleanse your crystals? Once a week. I would not wait. The only reason why I say that is because, the only reason why I say that is because once they sell out, I don't know when I'll get them back, okay? My crystals are ethically sourced, meaning that they are from Madagascar, they're from Zimbabwe, and they are also from Zambia, right? And they are very inexpensive, all right? And I also, when you order crystals, I always add something free in them, all right? I always add something free in them. So, crystals for court case. Oh, no, I got you because I never even thought about that. Crystals for court. I want to say tiger's eye, but black tourmaline, black tourmaline. Are there any proof that crystals do what? Okay, so let me tell you about moss agate real quick, okay? Let me tell you something about moss agate because I want to read these to you, all right? Do you need crystals to manifest? No, you don't need it, but it helps, okay? So let me read to you what moss agate does, all right? Moss agate. Moss agate is the crystal of wealth. It helps with prosperity, success, abundance, compatibility, and strength, okay? So moss agate is a stone of new beginnings. It refreshes the soul and enables you to see beauty in all you behold. Moss agate reduces sensitivity to weather and environment pollutants. It attracts abundance and wealth and improves self-esteem, all right? 
What about centrine for mentality during course? Centrine is definitely for uh, like wealth and sacral chakra. The solar plexus, my bad. Carnelian. Carnelian is great for creativity. It's also great if you're a fire sign. If you want to get crystals based off of your, um, can you share your crystals with another person? I wouldn't recommend it. If you want to get crystals based off of your zodiac sign, go ahead and comment your zodiac. What website are you using? I'm using my website. The link is in the buy click crystal shop if you want to go ahead and purchase a crystal, okay? Is there an appetite increaser? Let's see. Everything is talking about weight loss. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So everything is talking about weight loss. So I'm not really sure, but I would recommend something with the solar plexus. So citrine is a solar plexus crystal. All right. So let's start with Aries. Okay. Now, listen, let me tell you something. I'm going to give you one more warning. Okay. You're going to try and save that crystal in your cart. It is going to sell out. Okay. You go ahead and think I'm playing. The crystal is going to sell out. So when you know what you want, because I'm about to name them. When you know what you want, get it as soon as possible because it's going to sell out. It's the last time I'm saying this, all right? So I'm going to give you a code now. If your order is over $50, use this code to get free shipping, okay? Ship me. Save the code. Um, um, Roro, Serona, can you please put that code and let them know? Ship me is a code for if your order is over $50, okay? So... Let's start. I'm going to start with crystals for Aries, all right? I'm going to start with crystals for Aries, all right? Now, this is about to go wild, okay? So crystals for Aries. Green. Yes, I ship everywhere. Crystals for Aries. Green aventurine, okay? Carnelian, all right? And I'm going to go slow. I am going to go slow because I don't want to hear no excuses, okay? Crystals for Aries. Carnelian, amethyst. Green Aventurine, Rose Quartz, Bloodstone, Tiger's Eye, Fluorite, Pyrite, okay? And if you need something to cleanse your crystals, get Selenite, all right? Selenite is on there also, okay? So, Gemini. I'm going to do all the, crystal, all the signs, don't worry. So now we're doing Gemini. Crystals for Gemini, Moonstone, Citrine, Caribbean Calcite, Tiger's Eye, Rutal Quartz. What do you do with your crystals when you get them? You meditate with them, okay? Rutal Quartz, Amazonite, Chrysocolla. This is for Gemini, all right? Let me say it one more time. Amethyst. Chrysocolla, Amazonite, Tiger's Eye, Moonstone, Citrine, Caribbean Calcites, Rutile Quartz, all right, and Obsidian, okay? I have a YouTube video on my channel. Click the link in the bio on my YouTube channel and look up how to meditate or just look up meditate. I have a video on it, okay? So, Taurus. Crystals for Taurus, Rose Quartz, Moss Agate, Carnelian, Clear Quartz, Labradorite, Sodalite, Green Aventurine, Black Tourmaline, Lapis Lazuli, okay? Lapis Lazuli. All right? That's Taurus. All right. Cancer. Crystals for cancer. Amethyst. Citrine. Tiger's eye. Smoky quartz. Smoky quartz. Moonstone. Carnelian. Amethyst. Rondonite. Selenite. That's for cancer. I have not done Aquarius yet. Let's do it now. Aquarius. The link is in the bio. Click crystal shop to purchase the crystals that you're looking for. All right. Crystals for Aquarius. Amethyst. Amazonite. Rose quartz. Labradorite. 
okay? Black tourmaline. Have you done Libra? No. I have not done Pisces yet. All right? So that's Aquarius. Aquarius, lapis lazuli, amethyst, labradorite, rose quartz, amazonite. All right? Pisces. Crystals for Pisces, rose quartz, blue lace agate, moonstone, Caribbean calcite, amethyst, carnelian, clear quartz, sodalite, fluorite, bloodstone. What's your go-to crystal for anything? For, every, for anything, my go-to crystal and my favorite crystals are chevron, amethyst, and pyrite, period. Period. All, every single time. Every time you ask me that, the, the answer is going to be that. Answer is always going to be that. All right. All right. So, Leo. Crystals for Leo. Tiger's eye. Carnelian. Black tourmaline. Citrine. Labradorite. Clear quartz. Tiger's eye. Amazonite. All right. Scorpio. I need some, some for tension to flow. I got you. I got you. I got you. I recommend Labradorite, Serona. Sagitt Scorpio. For Scorpio, Malachite, Citrine, Obsidian, Lapis Lazuli, um, Onyx, Smoky Quartz, Amethyst. Lapis lazuli, black tourmaline, okay? Sagittarius. For Sagittarius, the link is in the bio click crystal shop to purchase these crystals, okay? The link is in the bio click crystal shop. All right. Amethyst the most for flow, right? Um Sagittarius, malachite Blue lace agate, amethyst, citrine, labradorite, clear quartz, malachite. <laughs> All right. Okay. Can you do Aquarius again? Yes, I can. Aquarius. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. She dev doesn't like Scorpios. What are you talking about, my love? My birthday is October 23rd. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Aquarius, Amethyst, Amazonite, Rose Quartz, Blue Lace Agate, Labradorite, Amazonite, Lapis Lazuli, all right? I wish I did. I have any pictures of crystals? I don't think so. I don't got no pictures of crystals. I just added some beautiful labradorite onto the website. Yeah. All right, Taurus. I got you, Taurus. Let's do um. Let's do Virgo first. First though, Virgo. Crystals for Virgo, lapis lazuli, amazonite, carnelian, fluorite. I got you, Capricorn. Clear quartz, carnelian, lapis lazuli, citrine, amethyst, carnelian, moonstone, lapis lazuli, fluorite, tiger's eye. This is for Virgo, tiger's eye, all right? Tiger's eye, all right? Capricorn. Crystals for Capricorn. The crystals for Capricorn is rose quartz, onyx, um, amethyst, tiger's eye, fluorite. All right. What are y'all looking for in crystals, too? Because I want to make sure, like, you don't have to only get crystals based off of your sign, too. All right. That's another thing. Like, for example, the one thing that I was saying is, like, if you're trying to manifest money, if you want to manifest money, citrine, moss agate, pyrite, 
okay protection is safety get obsidian or black tourmaline on the website i have bracelets let me sh you know what let me just let me just show you the website how about that how about that how about that okay comment what you're looking for in crystals comment what you're looking for in crystals and i'm going to show you which one is w what you should get right so for example right let's let's let's, just, let's do it like this okay for example right okay boom if you are trying to open your third eye, if you're trying to connect more to your spirituality, Labradorite is a great crystal to have, okay? Now, healing and protection is the most important for me, okay? So, boom, if you want protection, why wrap Labradorite? Why would you get protection? Because guess what? It says Labradorite has two characteristics, magic and protection, all right? Also, another one for protection is Lapis, right? This is another one for protection, this is another one for protection, right? I know you guys might not. So, boom. Manifestation. Lapis lazuli is good for manifestation, self-confidence, purification, intuition. A stone of protection that may be worn to guard against psychic attacks. All right? What else? What else are you looking for? What else are you looking for? I'm not sure about Moldavite. I don't have Moldavite. Good luck. If you're looking for good luck, look. Let's see. Can we type it? Do I have anything for like, do I have it any, anything typed? Boom. Good luck. Labradorite. Labradorite. And just so y'all can see, my Labradorite is on point. My lab. Look at this. This is the Labradorite that we have. If it play. Look at that. Look at that. That is beautiful. For inner child is the Labradorite. For inner child, Carnelian. For inner child, Carnelian. Come on, keep commenting. Keep commenting. Anger, for anger, I have a specific crystal for that. Anger, these are the crystals for anger. Blue lace agate, green aventurine, carnelian, amethyst. This is what the amethyst looks like. Oh, we basically sold out. We almost sold out. This is basically what the amethyst looks like. All right. Also, another one that y'all sleep on is malachite y'all are asleep on the malachite on here right so we'll go ahead click crystals malachite malachite right look malachite can be a powerful ally for those waiting for their reality to change it reminds us that we have to come here to co-create the universe that helps in identifying the steps necessary to bring dreams vision and wishes into physical reality Malachi stimulates dreams and brings memories vividly to life. It is also an excellent stone for the rebirthing process, providing easy disposal of opposing encounters, right? Malachi is a protection stone absorbing negative energies and pollutants from the atmosphere and from the body. It guards against radiation of all kinds, clears electromagnetic pollution, and heals earth energies. Keep near mi microwaves and kitchens and televisions and living areas. I ship everywhere. Malachi expensive. Yeah, because Malachi is a very powerful stone. Malachite is a very powerful stone. You know what? You know what? You know what? Malachite is a very powerful stone. Right? Moss agate. Moss agate is literally the crystal of wealth, prosperity, success, abundance. Right? Moss agate is a stone of new beginnings. Right? It attracts abundance and wealth and improves self-esteem. Crystals for manifesting instantly. Malachite, moss agate, pyrite. Look at what we sold out already. Because I done told y'all. Moonstone done already sold out. The Lapis done sold out. The Malachi bracelets done sold out. The Sodalite bracelets done sold out. Come on now. This is Florid Pyrite. A very rare crystal, right? Look. This is great for that manifesting question, right? Look. Fluorite with Pyrite will guide you down the path of abundance and blessings. Right? So that's fluorite or pyrite. Hold on, let's keep it going because because uh, yeah, I don't know. Citrine. Look at this bracelet, man. Boy, look at it. I had to keep I had to keep one for myself. Citrine. Great for abundance. Great for money. Black tourmaline for protection. You see that lapis pyrite bracelets? Come on, y'all. Y'all not gonna find nowhere else. You are not going to find pyrite bracelets anywhere else, bro. Pyrite is a stone of abundance also. Don't worry, y'all. I'm going to update all of these, 
all of these so I can um put the definitions in it. Don't worry, I got y'all. I got y'all. Right? Because y'all sleeping on the new stuff, bro. Y'all sleeping. Chrysocola. Chrysocola Tiger's Eye. This is some of the most high quality Tiger's Eye that I've ever had on the website. Selenite. This is what you use to cleanse your crystals. Pyrite. Great for abundance. Great for abundance. Do they have a bracelet with all different stones? No, I don't have a bracelet with all different stones. Most of the crystals are just one, all right? Citrine, like I told you, great for abundance, money. Yeah, man, y'all sleeping. This is black tourmaline quartz. Look at this, tourmaline quartz. That's clear quartz and black tourmaline put together, right? Man, y'all sleeping on your girl. Y'all sleeping on your girl. African bloodstone. You may benefit from bloodstone crystals if you can relate to any of the following. You are a serious energy healer. You seek courage. You need a second wind or strong start to the day. You're feeling cranky and frustrated. You want to get back on the same wavelength as a friend or a partner. You need support through your time of grief. You were born in the month of March or the Zodiac Pisces, right? It grants protection, aids in decision making, brings clarity, bestows courage and wisdom, clears the space of negativity, grounds one in the present moment, helps act with courage, calms the emotional body, invigorates the physical body, nourishes the feelings of self-confidence. Come on now. Come on now. Y'all sleeping on... Come on, let's go, let's go, because... Get like your girl and get some bracelets, right? And make sure y'all follow me on Instagram, right? Look, Moss Aggie just sold out. Y'all saw it was here. It just sold out. Moss Aggie just sold out. Moss Aggie just sold out. The Labradorite, the Pyrite still there. The Chevron Amethyst is there. Chevron Amethyst is a great crystal for wealth. It's all, this is a crystal for opening your third eye right here. This crystal is great for opening your third eye. It's regular Amethyst Citrine. You know, any more questions, y'all? Wire wrap. What we got for wire wrap? Citrine, Rutile Quartz, Green Onyx, Green Aventurine. What's Green Aventurine good for? Aries, Leo, right? Creativity, imagination, independence, prosperity, calmness, career success, balance, right? Aventurine is a stone of prosperity. It reinforces leadership qualities and decisiveness. Promotes compassion and empathy. Encourages perseverance, right? You know, so... You know, I'm here to put y'all on, put y'all babies on. That's what I'm here for. Green Jasper. Chrysocola. Health. Health. Okay. I got you. Amazonite. I looked up, I looked up health and guess what came up? Amazonite. The website. I got you. The website is in the link in the bio, but you can go ahead. I'm typing it now. Manhurts.com. See, right. What was the bracelet for opening the third eye? Chevron amethyst. This is opening the third eye. Chevron amethyst. I'm not sure about Moldavite. Not educated on that one. All right. So what? It, what come on now. Ask your questions. What you looking for, girl? What you looking for? What you looking for? What you trying to do? What you looking for? Moss Agate, this child, listen, listen, I know y'all probably like, oh my God, it's expensive, but look how big this is, y'all. This right here is the crystal of wealth. This, look at this. This is the crystal of wealth. I have one of these big versions that sit on my desk. If you are a business owner, trust me, make the investment, get this crystal and put it on your desk. Trust me, this is the large. So if you pay this price, this is the large, okay? This is the large. Look, and let me give you a code. If you order this here, I'll give you a code right now. Use the code TikTok. Use the code TikTok. Use the code TikTok for 10% off if you get this crystal. So this is the large right here. And this is the small right here, the medium. This is the medium. Large, medium, all right? For health, somebody said, what was health again? I got you right now. 
Health. Amazonite. 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 It calms the brain, nervous system, and aids in maintaining optimum health. All the bracelets back in stock. Child, listen, I just put the bracelets on the website yesterday, child. Let me show you. Just because y'all y'all think I be playing. I just put all the bracelets on the website yesterday. Look at how much I already sold out. Lapis, Moss Agate, Malachite, Sodalite. Child, listen. If you if there's any if there's any bracelet I recommend y'all get is Pyrite. Because I don't know when I'll get these again. These were very rare. Will it have the same effect? Of course. They're crystals. You know? Care, you just need to make sure that your crystal is always on you if that's what you're looking for. If you want it to affect you in your day-to-day. -day. All right? Any other questions? Any other questions? Come on now. I'm here. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. What other questions you got? What other questions you got? Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram and subscribe to me on YouTube. What other questions y'all got, baby? I need some water. Hold on, let me get some water. Libra, I got you, Libra. Labradorite, I, I do know Labradorite is the crystal for Libra. Hold on, just get some water. Labradorite is the crystal for Libra. Labradorite, look. I just be having all my little my little crystals hanging around. This is black tourmaline on here with mica. I just be having all my crystals just laying around, y'all. So let me tell you about um let me tell you about Libra, okay? Am I late? Uh, I mean we at the end. What is the most powerful crystal in my opinion? I mean I don't think there's any most powerful, but I think the most most powerful would be definitely clear quartz. Clear quartz. What helps with anxiety and depression? I got you. Labradorite. So for would you get into making waistbands? Yeah. Can you set your, your site to notify when something is back in stock? Um, this is why I have the emails and the phone numbers. If you type in your phone number, you will get a, a message every single time that you that, that we restock. All right. So hold on. So Capricorn, I got you, Capricorn. I'm, I'm starting from the beginning, all right? Somebody said Capricorn. Crystals for my dear Cappies. Tiger's Eye, Fluorite, Moonstone, Howlite, Carnelian, okay? What does Malachite do? Somebody said, what does Malachite do? Malachite is very powerful, Malachite right here it says Malachite can be a very powerful ally for those waiting for their reality to change. It reminds us we have come here to co-create with the universe and helps in identifying the steps necessary to bring dreams, visions, and wishes into reality. It's also a protection stone. Okay. Awareness. Um, Labradorite is great for awareness. What helps with anxiety and depression? Labradorite. What can change my life? Malachite. <laughs> Malachite. Malachite. For Aries, get carnelian. Carnelian. Rose quartz. Rose quartz. The link is in my bio. The link is in my bio. Click crystal shop. Aries, get pyrite. Green aventurine. Aventurine. African bloodstone. Amethyst. Somebody said fertility. I got you. I got you fertility, carnelian. Well, look, 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 because y'all think I'm playing. Look, the carnelian just sold out. The carnelian just sold out. The carnelian just sold out. I'll be trying to tell y'all, get it before sale. Oh, hold on. And make sure y'all go ahead and check out my music, man. 
I got some dope spiritual music, man. Check me out. Link in the bio, click Stixis Music. Y'all check me out, bro. I'm going to play one thing on here. When I play it, you're going to be like, oh, no, I got to check Stix out. Let me, let me, let me play it. Malachite on there, yes. Link in the bio. Y'all check out my music. Link in the bio. Click Stix's music. This some thought music, man. Listen to this. This is me. That's crazy. That's crazy. I'll get Black Moose when I got you. Listen. That's me. That's me. Come on, man. That's what I'm telling y'all. Follow me on Instagram. Your girl is lit. Your girl is lit. All right. All right. Um, also, another thing I want to remind Chris is for letting go and releasing trauma. Um, Labradorite. Labradorite. And... Hold on. Labradorite, lapis lazuli, malachite, and moonstone for letting go and releasing the trauma. What are benefits of malachite? I got it gifted. I'm new to crystals. Um, malachite is a very powerful crystal that will help you transform your life, honestly. Um, it's also really good for bringing your manifestations into reality. All right. Jaden in here? That's that's Jaden. Jaden, that's you. Is that the Jaden that that sent me the video? Jaden, that's you that sent me the video the other day. Jaden, hi, Jaden. How are you, Jaden? You don't understand how much you lift my heart up when you sent me that video. For real, for real. What crystals for Libra? Labradorite. Jaden, I mess with you and I want to send you so much love. When I see videos of y'all, when y'all send me pictures of y'all and y'all send me videos of y'all, bro, y'all light me up because I'm able to see who I'm talking to. Crystals for reality shifts. Malachite. Malachite. Okay? So that's another thing. If you listen to my music, if you listen to my music, please follow me on Instagram and send me videos of you listening to it. Because it really puts things into perspective for me. For real, for real. Crystals that shouldn't go in salt water. Uh, You can look that up, but I'll look it up for you. I know, I know malachite should not be in water. Wa salt water unsafe crystals. Carnelian. Turquoise. Black tourmaline. Calcites, carnelian, angelites, opals, and moonstone. I appreciate you, Jaden. Thank you, Logan. I really love y'all, man. I don't think y'all know that. Like, look at my face right now. Like, I love y'all. For real, for real, man. Y'all changed my life. Y'all change. Y'all saying I'm changing y'all life. Y'all changing my life. Hey there, Eve the Queen. All right. Just got a Labradorite crystal from you. Hey. What books do you feed your mind? I'm going to listen. This is why. No, no. Subscribe to me on YouTube because my next video is going to be books that I, um, Books that I read. Subscribe to me on YouTube because my next video is going to be about. Look, look, look. I got. I just bought a whole box of books. I just bought a whole box of books. I just bought a whole box of books. So my next video is going to be about the books. All right. Thank you, Eve. I really appreciate that, man. For real. I really appreciate that. Let me give y'all another code, okay? 
So if you are on the crystal shop right now, use this code ship me or use the code TikTok if your order is over $50 to give you something off your order, you know. By the way, what inspired you along this path? Um, I think just trying to find out the truth, honestly, just trying to find the truth. Just trying to find the truth. That's really what did it. Do you prefer books or the Internet books? Because I get very distracted fast. ADHD, baby. One-on-one class schedule. If you want a one-on-one, DM me on Instagram. Okay? DM me on Instagram if you want a one-on-one. All right? If you want a reading. If you want a reading, DM me also if you want a reading. All right? If you want a reading, if you want a one-on-one, DM me on Instagram and we can get started. Period. But I'm going to let you know. I'm going to change your life, period. Period. All right? But, um, yeah, man. Let's play some music. 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 I feel like I know everything, but don't do anything. That means you're procrastinating. Make sure y'all subscribe to me on YouTube. Follow me on Instagram. Listen. But can you stop the How to be procrastination You gotta just get up You know I think working out will help you Thank you Jaden I know I'm a procrastinator sometimes too But you gotta You gotta understand that If you don't get up now Nobody's gonna do it for you The hateful world is draining because you're allowing it to drain you. Focus on the positive. And I know oh that I gotta keep my mind up on my side. Don't focus on the nigga sniffing. Hold on. All right. Link in the bio, click Sticks' is music. Uh. Take it aside. I'm moving like night. Got me questioning all the things I know. I follow the lights. I'm one with the night. I know the things that I know. Feeling like I reminisce, cause my soul feels so old. Learning is so relevant. I'm moving towards my soul. Enlightenment is my goal. I'm picking a side. I'm moving like Mike. Got me questioning all the things I know. I follow the light. I'm one with the night. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. That's what my music is about. That's what my music is about. That song is called Like Mike. Don't stress too much about that twin flame stuff, bro. Hear me out. I Y'all, low-key, I really feel like doing a Zoom. Y'all down to do a Zoom? I think, I'm thinking about doing a Zoom right now. I'm not even going to lie. I'm thinking about doing a Zoom. Let me download the Zoom. Let me download the Zoom app. I'm going to do a Zoom. What's this song called? That song was called I Can't Do Wrong. I'm about to do a Zoom. 
I'm about to do a Zoom. I'm about to do a Zoom. I'm going to do a Zoom. I'm going to do a Zoom. My Zoom's downloading, all right? I hope you're ready, because we're going to do a Zoom. I need your playlist. That's my song. Just go, literally, just go, link in the bio, and click link in the bio, click manifestation playlist. Okay. I gotta sign in. Hey man, y'all just might have to miss this one, bro. I'm sorry. I don't know what y'all want me to do. All right. Ooh, I'm about to put it in. All right, cool, cool, cool. I'm about to create a Zoom. Hey man, I'm about to create the Zoom, all right? Hold on. New meeting. New meeting. Oh, we're about to start. Okay, cool. Let me get this, okay? Let me get this, because we got the Zoom started now. I'm about to... How do I share this copy invite link all right bet all right bet okay look 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 okay hold on i done created the zoom how do i get the cord the not the cord the number for it Okay, y'all. All right, y'all. I'm going to post it on TikTok. Y'all go ahead and just be prepared, okay? Actually, let me put it in the link in the bio, okay? Let me just put it in the link in the bio. All right? So, the link, this is where the link is going to be. You're going to click the link in the bio that you usually go to when you go to my crystal shop right and what's gonna happen is is you're gonna click on where it says zoom meeting all right you're that's what you're gonna click on zoom meeting all right All right. Okay. We got a Zoom meeting. We do the Zoom meeting. All right. So go ahead. It's on there now. Go ahead and join the Zoom. All right. I'm about to go promote it on my TikTok. So you already know what's up. The link is in the bio. Click Zoom meeting. All right. See you there.